Hey guys, and today is Wednesday, and this was technically supposed to be my Fun Friday haul from last week, but whew, it's been crazy, so I didn't get a chance to record the video then, so I'm recording it now. Um, my daughter and her boyfriend and our grandbaby live in New Orleans, so they were displaced, so they are here now, and um, it's just been crazy. So I wasn't able to record, but I am going to go through this stuff. I've got Christmas and some new Halloween stuff, and then just some regular stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and get started with mm, some of the Christmas stuff because it's right here. And they, they're, they've got some really cute stuff coming out. Um, I'm going to start with the fairy garden stuff just because it is right here. So they have this, and they have a few other pieces, but I only got a couple of them. So I got this one. It's really cute. It's just a brick, little brick house with the snowman on there. And then they have, let's see, they have the little gingerbread house. And, you know, they're all kind of painted funky, so you may want to repaint these, you know, kind of touch them up a little bit. But, I mean, other than that, they're pretty cute there. Then they have this one, which I just bought to kind of go with the little gingerbread house, and it's just a flat piece. And they have this cute little sleigh, and they all have a lot of glitter on them, so be ready for that. And then they have these so there's this one and ah, this one and that one and like I said they had other pieces but these were just the ones that I grabbed because <clears throat> I don't really use them all so I only grab the ones that I'm going to use then these are not new to Dollar Tree, but I've never found them. At least I've never seen them at Dollar Tree with the little ornaments on them. I see these at uh, Hobby Lobby and Michaels and stuff. So I don't know if Dollar Tree has had these. I know they've had <clears throat> the trees, but I don't remember them having little ornaments on them, but I could be wrong. But I know I've seen these at like Michaels and Hobby Lobby and they're definitely not a dollar. So and let's see and these are actually a new tag so there's the tag that they have on them now so got those two and i think there was another color but i'm not not 100 percent sure and then these two pieces they light up i got these almost the exact same ones at michael's last year for like 3.99 or 3.49 or something like that so I got these. I only got these two, and like I said, they light up. So I got those, and they're just, they're, they're really cute. So that's those. And then I got this ceramic truck that you can paint. It's just a white, you know, ceramic truck. And it does say Mary on the little banner there. So I thought that was cute. It's got the cute little wreath on there. So this would be a cute little project, or if you have like a white theme for Christmas, then you don't have to do anything. Maybe just paint the tree so you can kind of see the tree on there. That would be cute too. <clears throat> My voice is shot. And then we have these. Now these aren't new. I don't know about the size though. Usually I get the bigger ones. Um, so I did go ahead and grab the green and the white and you get six of them in here. And I just like using these for like my minis and stuff like that. So I got those. And these are definitely new. The gnome cutouts. And I just realized that her nose is crooked when I was going through my, you know, going through the bags. But it's okay. You can't really tell. Like it doesn't really look bad. So obviously you can do whatever you want with these. I mean, you got to, of course, check them out. Like the feet are kind of wonky there, but... It's not a big deal. If you paint them up, you'll never know. And they're so cute. And I think these were the only two that I, they had. I could be wrong, but I grabbed, I went through everything, and these are the only two um, they had. So I grabbed those. And then the last Christmas item that I got, yeah, 
for just these ornaments. Not new, but I really like these and you get uh, five of these. And I just like using these again for minis and for like signs and stuff like that. So these work out really, really good for those. Now, <clears throat> this next one, these next few items that I got, I love them. I love them. Okay, so they have three, and they had they come in red and they come in blue. I believe, yeah, they come in red and blue. You can see on the side there. So you get the truck. You get the river camper. And you get the RV. <laughs> How cute are those? And they're little planters. You can just put some succulents in there or whatever. But oh my goodness. How adorable are these? Seriously, how adorable. So I got those. And I didn't get the red because I don't like red. So I got those. But if for Christmas, if you wanted to get the red ones, you could do like a... Um, Oh, National Lampoon's vacation theme and like, you know, put little signs and stuff on them. That would be really cute. But yeah, so I got those three and I love them. So the next thing I got were these awesome decorative knobs. They are cute. Oh my gosh, they're so gorgeous. So I only got this style, but they had like a pink and it was a different, you know, different uh, design. And they also had like a crystal one. They had two different crystal ones. I think the crystal ones were like, one was a ball and one was like the shape of a diamond. I can't remember what the pink one was, but I got four of these because they are just, I don't know what I'm going to use them for, but I have a couple of dressers out in the garage that I'm trying to refinish and I have a desk that I made, that might be nice, a desk for the drawers. So I'm not sure what I'm going to use them for, but I got those. And then this now this glass is really really delicate so definitely be careful with if you you know you buy one of these but they had different designs and this just that same as that concrete that had like little wire toppers to them it's the same kind of style this is just concrete and again this is really really delicate glass so definitely just be careful um you know when you're transporting it because i almost broke this one so I got those and then I found they had a bunch of different um, new ribbons. If I can find the picture, I thought I took a picture of the ones that came in this like pack. I only got this one. They had one that was like a honeycomb. Now I know they had some that came out not too long ago and they were thicker. These are all the same size and they had the honeycomb, the bee, and I can't remember what the other ones were, but if I find the picture, I'll put it on the screen somewhere so you can see the different ones that they had. And then I got this little bag. It's just a ladies clear plastic bag. Um, I don't know. I figured I could use it for some craft items like stickers or something like that. It's pretty, you know, it's a decent little size there. Or you could use it for makeup or anything like that. But I like that it had this, these little pockets in the front. And they had like red and blue also, but I got that one. Then I got these little scope, um, like mini toothbrushes. It's just so you can throw them in your purse, you know, just to keep it fresh, keep it fresh. So I got those. And then I found these. So this is a conceal palette. This is a contour palette. And it's by B-I-B-Y-S brand. Now I Googled these before I started recording and each of these was like seven to nine dollars depending on where you, you know, you bought them from. So to find them for a dollar, now I only found one of these at the store and I grabbed two of the contour ones. I, again, don't really wear makeup, um, but my daughters do. So I grabbed those for them and again I think I've said it before one of my daughters is in cosmetology school right now so I try to just grab stuff so in case she needs it or she wants to practice and even if she doesn't use it um, my youngest just likes to play with makeup so for a dollar you know I don't mind letting her just kind of mess around with it but like when I find the good brands and like really good stuff I try to just grab them for my older ones so that they can 
you know, have good makeup. And, um, you know, my daughters are darker complexion, so when I find stuff that's for the dark, you know, for darker skin, I definitely grab it because it's harder to find, you know, at the Dollar Tree. So I always grab that stuff. Now, next thing I'm going to do is like Halloween and fall just because it's right in front of me. And I didn't grab a whole lot, but I really like these. Now, these are salt and pepper shakers. They are not new, but I've never been able to find them. Like every time I've gone, they've been, they're already sold out. So I did finally grab a pair and I probably won't use them as salt and pepper shakers. Um... Just because they're cute and I figured these would be good for like a tear tray or anything like that so there's that and they had like an owl and a squirrel like owls and squirrels I think so I didn't get those and then I got these cute little I guess it's like table scatter or something I don't know but they're like little jewels these are pumpkins these are acorns not pine cones acorns and um <laughs> They're just, they're really cute. They're just little pumpkins and you know, you can use them as table scatter or put them in like a little clear, like even if you wanted to put them in something like this, you don't want to use this as a candle holder. You just want to put these in there. That would be cute. I mean, you can use them for so many different things, but so yeah, I got those two and these are the only two like designs that they had or like shapes that they had. So I don't know if there's anything else. And then I got these little sunflowers. And if I remember, I will put in the um, the description box a link that I have where I use these. And it turned out the little, oh, it was so cute. It was just so cute. So I grabbed a couple more because I had only bought the one pack last time. And I was kind of regretting that I didn't get more. So I was glad to see these. And they do have a bigger size also. And I think you get like three in the bigger, three or four of the bigger ones. And you get six of these. So I grabbed those. Now, I don't do a whole lot of Halloween, but when I saw this, along with something else that I found at the Dollar Tree, I think this is going to be a good little Halloween decor. I'm not sure if it's going to work out yet, but we're going to try it, and I will post that on my DIY channel. So be sure to head over there and subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you're notified so you can see what I do with all this stuff. Um... Yeah, so this one I think might glow in the dark. Yeah, this one glows in the dark. They have another one that's more like a natural, like beige wood color. Not wood, beige bone color. But I like this glow in the dark one. So I grabbed that one. Then I got these little necklaces. You get four of them. And they're just like skull and bones. And I have an idea for a mini. Hopefully it'll work. Um, I always say that, but we'll see. I think it's going to be cute. And that'll be definitely good for like a tear tray to just kind of decorate a tear tray. So keep that in mind. And then I found this cool little flower and it lights. Oh no. No. It's supposed to light up. Oh, there we go. Okay. So it does lights up and it's just so cute and I love the little paper I'm gonna save that and use it in a journal but I thought that was adorable and to me it doesn't really throw off Halloween vibes it's just a flower so you know I'll use it in something and the color does it change no it stays the same so I just thought that was cute so I grabbed one of those and they had other colors um I don't orange and black maybe I don't remember but I just got the one and I love this. So it's a lace table runner and it's black and it looks like spider webs. Oh, I love it. And it has like spiders on it, but I'm not going to use it as a table runner. I'm going to be using it for some other stuff, but I just thought that was, that was perfect. I love that. Look at that. So that was the only color that they had. And I thought that was, that was pretty cool. So I got that one. And then they had these little folding lanterns with LED lights. So I'll probably set this up, take a picture, and kind of add it to the screen here. But I've got this one. They had like three or four different ones. But of course, I got the purple one because I like purple. I guess that's what it's supposed to look like once it's 
set up and lighted lighted once it's lighted once it's lit <laughs> um that's what it's supposed to look like so i got that one and then i found this is not i think I'm, that's it for like the halloween oh no 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 hold on I'll show you that later because it's underneath everything. But <laughs> then I found this cute little um, kitchen set. And it's a dishwashing set. You get the little basket or the drying rack. And then you get just like one set of dishes. It has the plate, the cup, spoon, fork, knife. Then you get the dishwashing detergent. Oh, you get two plates. Yeah, so you get the cute little set. I like it. And this was the only color, like a basket. Usually they have... Like two different colors but they only had the yellow so i grabbed that one my son's been trying to get at it since i got it and i keep saying no it's mine it's mine it's mine <laughs> so there's that then i found some stationary stuff so i've been seeing people with these and i hadn't found them they're expanding document case and i hadn't found them at mine and i finally got one and I, I like it. I think it'll be good to just kind of put stickers in or paper or whatever. Um, and they had like the blue and I think green or orange for the little elastic part there. So I tried to find the blue one. And then I found these two. Now, you know, coupon folder things are not like new there. Oh, one of them doesn't have the, the papers, the little tabs. And this one does. Yeah. Oh man. Oh well. Okay, so anyway, you're supposed to get the little stickers for the tabs for the inside. This one doesn't have it, but it's okay. Um, I'm not going to use them for that anyway, but these are not new, but the colors are new. They're both like pastel. This one's pink, this one's purple, and uh, I don't know. I have an idea. Hopefully, what I'm thinking will work. I think it's going to be fine. I think it's going to work out perfect so we'll see like i said check out my diy channel and you'll be able to see what i do with all this stuff and look at this little um uh crossbody bag they had different designs but i thought my daughter would like this one that is adorable and it's got the pink strap on it and it's the juncture brand i just thought that was so cute she's gonna love it so i got her that one and then i got this but I'm not going to use it for this. I'm actually going to use it for my die cutting machine. Now, yes, I have a Cricut, but there's just some stuff that I like to use the die cutting machine for. And I don't like, I can't, those plates are expensive and they're ridiculous. So these are really thick. It's either this or the wood cutting boards, which are hard to find at my stores. And these work really well. So I just got another one to kind of use as a wedge because... I needed another one so I got that one I'll just remove all the stuff and take the glittery part off and it'll work just fine so then I got stickers yes stickers 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 so they came out with some new stickers these are kind of like puffy stickers so they had this one I just thought this was cute with the little coffees and the cute little dog there so I got that one and look at that one so I love, this is like my, these are my favorite, the ones with the coffee cups and the mug. So these are just really cute. And these are just kind of like 3D ones. They're not puffy. They're like pop-up stickers. So I got that one. And then I got these. Now I've hauled these before, but I got a couple different shapes this time. So I just grabbed one of each. And I think these are just good for journals. Kind of, you can um, stain them a little bit, kind of roughen up the edges, and these will be cute, you know, vintage stickers. So I got those. Then I found these. Oh, these are cute. See, and then you could probably take like one of these stickers down here and kind of put it on top of that and give it that vintage look. That would just be cute. So, you know, and then they have this one, which kind of matches. Maybe not. I don't think I have one that matches that, but they do have other sets or like even the chalkboard stickers that they have would match. So you can just kind of make your own little layered sticker. I like these. These are like um, inspirational ones. There's there's always hope. Don't lose hope. You never know what tomorrow may bring. Pain is real, but so is hope in all things. So this I like these. These are cute. And this is absolutely my favorite one right here. That, that is adorable. So... 
got those and then I got these and I got it mostly for this sticker right here I love the suitcases and stuff and then so you get that and then you get the letters back here I love stickers and obviously as you all know and I got this one I think I got this one primarily for the key and like this one because that kind of reminds me of a disc like a floppy disc so I like that one and they have those and then you get more letters and then I got these for an upcoming DIY a collaboration that I'm a part of although I don't know now that I have them if I'm actually going to use these or not so either way I'll use them for something and then I found these new pens these I love these although they are like the barrel is pretty thick um, so it kind of makes it hard for me to write with just because I'm used to writing with like thinner pens but I like these so I got those and then okay all right, guys, so give me a second. So I'm, oh, let me show you this. So I got white out. This is the first time I've seen the, the Bic version of it. Usually it's just like the Dollar Tree brand. So I love using that white out. And then I got some more tacky glue because my, daughter my daughters have been journaling with me. And sometimes I only have like one box. I've only had like one bottle of glue. And so it's hard to like share one. So I just got another one. And I did grab a couple of these. I just used one of them in a DIY that I just did. And if I remember, I will link it down below. Um, but yeah, so I got a couple more of these. And I like the ones that are just like normal handles. They do have one. I think it's a star. So I just like the normal one. Okay. So I was really excited when I found this stuff. Although, hmm. Okay, so I'm just going to show you. Hold on. So they have wood. All kinds of wood different shapes wood shapes different shapes of wood so these are not new but these are bigger than the ones that they usually have these are more the size of like the ones you get at Michaels or Hobby Lobby they're bigger much bigger so I got one of those then they had the six hexagon and just these now I didn't get a bunch of these because it's not a good value for the dollar but um they had these and then they had different lengths of like the wood so I got the two longer ones they also had like shorter ones which I just didn't it didn't make sense to get because it was like half of this for a dollar like why would you buy the smaller one so I didn't grab those but I did grab these just to show you and then look at these <laughs> how stinking cute are these now I found out that there's only two of these per box so this was a couple of different stores um, there's only two so unless you catch them right when they stock them you may not find them but they come in the same box as all that other stuff so how cute are these oh the possibilities so cute okay then uh, let's see I found some more gold toe socks these are like the no-show for men and then these are two the longer ones for women and my husband liked these so I grabbed him a couple more because I did take one of his so <laughs> I bought him those and then okay check this out buffalo check vinyl look at that so I got those two and they I think these were the only two colors that they had so I grabbed these and the last thing are these window clings and this was part of the fall stuff but it was all the way on the bottom so I'm just showing it to you now but look at that that's so cute I love this one the sweater weather one this would be cute for a DIY. These are adorable. So there's that. And that is the end of my haul, guys. Um, like I said, check out my DIY channel to see what I do with all this stuff. And if you're not already subscribed here, please hit that subscribe button. Hit the like button, button and hit the notification bell so you're notified every time that I upload. And again, I'm sorry I didn't upload on Friday. It has just been 
insane. So um, hopefully I can get you another video out on Friday. If not, check out my DIY channel. I will be posting lots of videos this month. I'm part of a lot of challenges and collaborations this month. So definitely check that out. And guys, until next time, be blessed and be the reason someone smiles. Bye.